In this tutorial, I will show how to protect domain objects from X dashboard delete. So, domain objects is very sensitive, and you need to uh, safely utilize. And also, all the system administrators need to aware that, that domain objects not get deleted or some way not get harmed because it will ultimately affect the company itself so I can create a user there and I'm going to create a user of the login name next give a password and uh, I'm going to create a user first like next and uh, next for sure this user is like created a user but I at the other hand also can delete the user so it's as simple as that create another one delete and it ultimately suffers to those guys those employees which have their password which have their username on the server and somewhere they try to log in and and they're not able to get because the username is actually deleted so you can you, you don't you can't do it that time because your username should be run as safe your username should be uh, survived so what do we need to do like when you create a, a url so you see a check sign there protect container from accidental delete the such kind of thing is not available when you create a user or group but when you uncheck that which is like OU is really important thing and once you create an OU it means you try to put a, a domain objects on it but uh, I can create a, another OU and uh, I remains a check that and create a secure and remains that okay so I have two OU right now once I am not unchecked object shouldn't delete and another you know, when you try to delete it will say you do not have a sufficient privilege because it's checked but when you see those two views and those two advanced features you will find lots of features there and uh, also when you see the fact that properties of a user will find lots of users to look lots of uh, things is there you find another thing called object cache and you will find a protect object from accidental delete and in, in a simple uh, configuration you don't find this but right now you can see you do not have privilege because we just uh, check uh, accidental tab and right click and go to Unchecked, we checked it, and uh, when you try to delete this OU you know, before it's uh, unsafe, but right now it's saved. When you go to secure also, but it is not giving you a privilege to delete, you go to properties, and we will again, again, go to uh, their program data. Which I am trying to delete, so it will not be able to delete secure. You can do password, properties, object. You can see when you uncheck once again, we try to delete this OU, it will delete it. So it's like a, I checked on program data, so it will not going to delete. Also, with the user is not gonna delete this object, just uh, uncheck that in order to delete. So, when you uncheck the past features, you just do take from delete, user can delete it because secure object is still alive so if you get the feature 
this option on view of the advanced feature 